His name is Starscream. He is one of the most cruel, ruthless, and treacherous Transformers ever to grace the ranks of the evil Decepticons. Or at least he was. It's up there. Somewhere. My world. My home. The place where I learned to fight. To cheat. To betray for the Decepticons. Nah, not for the Decepticons. For myself. And it's up there somewhere. Cybertron. I've dreamed of ruling it. Of commanding the Decepticons to final victory over the Autobots there. I've lost <laughs> count of those. Autobot and Decepticon alike. I've gladly annihilated in pursuit of that aim. And yet ultimately, here on Earth, that aim almost cost me my life. Condemned to a living death in a deep sleep capsule by three Autobots. I've lain here for months. Yes, it doesn't matter, because when the capsule opened, so did my eyes. Commanding the Decepticons, winning the Autobot War, forget it. I just want to see my home again. Uh, excuse me, you're a Transformer, aren't you? And you're an aggravation I could do without. Get lost. What's your name? Are you deaf or just stupid? I said go away! It's a sure sign of how bad things are when I can't even stir up the enthusiasm to squash a fleshling. Boy, are you a miserable lump of metal. It's Christmas Eve! You should be happy! It's a time for hope, of joy, and of annoying little pests. But the last time, leave me alone. No, no, I won't! If you knew what Christmas was all about, you'd soon cheer up. And you don't know, do ya? Admit it. Oh, how do the Autobots manage to stay friendly with this species? Very well. Accessing internal data file. Subhead, Earth vocabulary. Christmas, date, December 25th. Annual festival celebrating Christ's birth. Features include family, reunion, gift giving, and so on. Okay, now, buzz off and leave me in peace. No, no, no! It's not like that at all! Not mechanical! You just don't understand the spirit of Christmas! Let me explain. No, let me explain this! One more word from you, and you won't be around to see in your precious Christmas day. Understand? Y yeah, I, I get the message. Just, just put me down and I'll go home. <laughs> home. How simple you make that sound. You have a home. You can easily get there. I envy you, fleshling. Go. Do what I cannot. Go home. You're still here, aren't you? Y yes Look, if you just let me show you what Christmas really means, I'm sure you'll be a lot happier. Oh, you insist. Whoa! Neat transformation! Alright! Where are we going? I don't know. Which direction is this spirit of Christmas, then? Uh... Well, just follow this road. If we're lucky, we'll see some people giving presents to each other. I can hardly wait! Mock if you will, but you've got to understand the feeling that goes with the presents. They're the real gifts of Christmas. That's how the needy receive comfort, the hopeless receive hope. The very act of giving is the greatest feeling of all. Ha! Only the weak give, the strong take. Your mind turns the same way as an Autobot's human. At least try and keep your mind open, eh? Hey! That bus is stuck in a snowdrift! Take us down! Whoa! Boo! Good catch! Look, the bus is packed with elderly people, probably on their way to their Christmas celebrations. I bet they've been looking forward to this trip all year, and now they're freezing cold, stuck in a snowdrift. So? So help them! Free the bus, and think of it as your Christmas gift to them! But, but what's in it for me? Trust me, 
Just do it and you'll see. You'll be surprised. Back off, Deceptor Creep. Don't worry, humans. Streetwise is here to save you. Lucky for you, I scanned Starscream as he overflew. Unlucky for him. This protector bot will make sure he never bothers you again. Uh, too busy listening to that dumb kid. Didn't see him until it was too late. Again, it's never too late to scrap an Autobot. Heck, I can't have got him. But in this way, I now maneuver him. And we're close in enough to do this. Oh, that was close. What? Something tells me these boys ain't filling for Santa this year. Now, Decepticon scum, you die. It's you who's gonna... Stop! Stop this now! You darn fool, Autobot. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. This Decepticon wasn't trying to harm people. He was trying to help them. Because of your trigger-happy mentality, those people nearly did get hurt. Don't you see? When you think with your fists, you become as bad, if not worse, than your enemy. And now, Autobot, watch and weep. There you go, humans. You're free. Hey, good on you, big fella. You're a regular 50-foot Santa boy. I... I don't get it. No Decepticon ever. <laughs> it's just because... It's Christmas! Yeah, well, I'm still gonna escort this vehicle to its destination. You sure you want to do it with the Decepticon, human? Yep, I'll be okay. Thanks, son. Take care. Have a good one, old fella. So you see, in giving hope and comfort to others, you receive reassurance too. Maybe next time, it's you who will get help with your problems. Hardly human. Oh, come on. You can't tell me you weren't pleased when those people on the bus cheered you? You misunderstand my pleasure, human. I was merely happy to see the humiliation of the Autobot. You... you don't mean that, do you? Is that really all that incident meant to you? I... I, I don't know what to say, ex except... well... Merry Christmas. Ha! Merry Christmas, kid. Optimus Prime? He's Jewish?